Welcome to the Two-Way Street Coffee House. We're so glad you could join us. We're broadcasting here from Downers Grove, Illinois, but we're so excited to bring all the way from Australia, Charma Finches. And Hello, everybody. <laughs> it's going to be an amazing show. You're in for such a treat. Um, their manager reached out to us because they were trying to break them into the American market, and you are into your... Oh, it's going to be so amazing. Yeah, I can't wait for the show, and you should look for them when they come through in person. I mean, I'm predicting it's going to be like October 2022, but we'll see how that goes. But we'll, we'll hope see. you see them there. And <laughs> yeah. um, we'll enjoy them tonight. And thank you for coming tonight. Um, yeah, thanks for having us. For anyone in the audience, I just want to say tomorrow we have a sing around at 2 p.m. Central Time. Just come in person, bring your favorite song, and you can uh, sing and kind of go around in a circle. And everybody that's there gets to sing a couple of songs. It's really delightful. And then next Friday we have sanctified grumblers um they're gonna go they're virtual as well right yep and pretty soon we're gonna be going to in person and virtual so look forward to that as well something new on our horizon so thanks for paying attention tonight and don't forget to donate at twowaystreet.org yes so tonight we're bringing you charm of finches an award-winning Melbourne sister duo, Charm of Finches, sing haunted folk tunes about love, grief, and whispering trees with tight sibling harmonies and chamber folk sound. Mabel and Ivy Windred Warren emerge from an eclectic musical childhood of Celtic strings and busking old-time tunes. Their debut album, Staring at the Starry Ceiling, produced by Nick Huggins, was praised for its candor and originality and named one of the best releases of 2016 by ABC Radio National. Charma Finch has independently released their sophomore album, Your Company, in November 2019, touring Australia widely. This album was Melbourne's PBS Radio Album of the Week, winner of the Best Folk Singer-Songwriter Album in the 2020 Independent Music Awards, and nominated for the Music Victoria Award for Best Folk Album and the prestigious 2020 Australian Music Prize. At the start of 2020, they showcased at the Folk Alliance International Conference in New Orleans. They were one of 96 artists selected worldwide to participate in the first global music match. They are currently recording their third album to be released through Anti-Fragile Music in 2021. We are thrilled to present tonight, Charm of Finches. Ladies, please take it away. Thank you. Thanks a lot. <laughs> all right. <clears throat> How you all doing out there? Let us know where you're tuning in from. We are here in Melbourne in lockdown once again. It is 11 in the morning. Quite nice and sunny outside. 
All right. We're going to start off with a song called Fish in the Sea, which is off our last album that we released in 2019. Hello, Anna. Anna. Yay. Hello, Jennifer. Sorry, we're looking <laughs> down. The comments are down the there. The comments are down there. <laughs> Thanks for joining us uh, this morning or evening, depending on where you are in the world. Um, we are Charmer Finches. If you've just joined us here, we're from Melbourne, Australia. We are sisters. If you can't 
can't tell. <laughs> this is Ivy. This My is name's... Mabel. Yeah, there you go. We're sitting on our couch in our lounge room. Yeah, it's a sunny day. All right. <clears throat> We're going to play a song inspired by a, uh, a book that we read a few years ago that you may know called Catcher in the Rye. And um, there's a scene in that book where uh, Holden Caulfield, who's the main character, uh, is in the cab and they're driving past the lake and it's all frozen and he asks the cab driver where the ducks go in the winter um, and what the fish do if they're frozen inside the ice or if they're just chilling out underneath. Uh, so got me thinking and started writing this song inspired by that and other musings. So there you go. It's called Where the Where Do the Ducks Go? <clears throat> so cold that the lake turns to glass Oh, where do the ducks go? Is all I ask And what do the fish do? Are they frozen in? And when it gets so dark that the ants cannot see Oh, how do they find their way to their homes underneath? And where do the birds where do they all go? Do they all have houses in the clouds? So I don't know. So I'll go ask the wise owl, go ask him, he might know all the answers to all of the things that I've wanted to know. Like, how does the grass grow? How to count up on my fingers and toes? And how do I stop my mind going places I don't want it to go? And when the morning light melts the ice upon my window pane, I wonder how long it will take for the sunlight to evaporate if the flowers on the back fence. If I watch them, will they bloom? And when the day is fading and the trees are bathed in gold, and the sun goes to sleep behind the hill as I've been told, if I listen closely, will I hear its sighing breath? Will it rise again in the morning or will it just forget? So I'll go ask the wise owl, go ask him, he might know all the answers to all of the things that I've wanted to know, like how does the grass grow? How to count up on my fingers and toes and how do I stop my mind? Going places I don't want it to go for the clappy hands. <laughs> All right. Hello, Tim. <laughs> Hi, Jennifer. Okay. Gonna, gonna sing one about jealousy. This is a song I wrote when I was feeling jealous and I wanted to try and make myself feel a little bit better. So... I made up a story about someone called Miranda. She's make-believe. And I'm sorry if anyone's called Miranda out there. This is not about you. I'm sure you're a lot nicer than this one such Miranda. 
she is feeling jealous and gets a little in her head. Things get a bit out of hand and I won't spoil what happens at the end. You can find out. <laughs> uh, this is going to be on our new record, which is coming out in October. There you go. Stay tuned. It's exciting stuff. <clears throat> Despite his devotion and all his affection, I wonder if she's too good for you. And on the lawn, together you'd lie, and all the clouds scuttle across the sky. And you wonder if you should just, you wonder if you should just let me. I'll pass you by, oh Miranda. Oh, how hard, oh, how hard you try. And her voice, it rings out across the room like many bells. And she talks as if She's always known him so very well And though she's never held a man You think maybe she can And the thought gives you hell And on the lawn Together you'd lie And all the clouds scuttle across the sky And you wonder just, you wonder if you should just let it all pass you by, oh Miranda, oh how hard, oh how hard Lovely to see you all here. Um, thanks morning, for joining Matt. us. Oh, thanks, Joel. Very lovely of you. <laughs> all right. If you've just joined us, we are Chama Finches. My name is Mabel. This is Ivy, my sister. And uh, we're coming to you from Melbourne, Australia. Um, hope you're enjoying your evening or morning or, or afternoon. 
whatever what? it is. Midnight. <laughs> 1 a.m. <laughs> um, okay, we're going to play uh, another song that we released this year. Um, and it's, uh, it's called Treading Water. And um, it's one of those sort of sad breakup songs about um, reminiscing on good times. Yeah. <laughs> oh, am I in the right capo? I don't think so. Oh, three. Oh. Stupid questions talked about the silly things. If only it could always be like this. We followed the path round the coast in the sunshine. You couldn't help but hold me to you close. When you touched me, I felt an aching fear of losing, fear of breaking. It took a while for that feeling. Thanks for sharing, Mark. <laughs> um, if you do like what you hear, uh, there 
is a donation link. Um, I think it's on the <laughs> Facebook page. Um, the Two Way Street Facebook page might need to um, get our friends to confirm that. Um, but yes, there is a donation link, um, which I'm sure will appear in the chat any moment now, um, which you can donate to if you would like. Um, yes, Ivy's just gone to get a forgotten instrument. <laughs> She's, well, she plays too many. Uh, I'm just going to play ukulele and I'm back. violin in this song. Um, not at the same time. <laughs> but um, yeah, this is one off our last album. And it's called The Bridge. Uh, and we wrote it a couple of years ago when we were on tour and um, we were going for a walk uh, across this bridge and we came across a group of young people who were sitting there um, and there were flowers around them and they looked pretty sad and uh, we found out that they'd had a party and one of their friends had jumped off this bridge for fun and unfortunately didn't make it and um, that was quite shocking for Ivy and I to hear and we went home and we were still thinking about it and I think um, it was particularly poignant for us because we'd also lost a friend when she was quite young, um, I think it was a year earlier, so yeah, we wrote this song and um, sort of uh, moved by that event, so yes, it's called The Bridge and we hope you like it. I walked away the head you used to go And I see your face in the cumulus clouds of the water down below And I wonder why you ever came here And you jumped so far that you'd always be falling into
Thanks very much. Thank you. <laughs> we had some comments about um, my mug and also probably yours too. But <laughs> <laughs> this is what is on my mug. <laughs> it's it's a cool. leopard with glasses on. Is it? Yeah. I thought it was a pineapple. What? <laughs> <laughs> no, that's a leopard. I've just never really looked at it close enough. That's a leopard, not a pineapple. <laughs> this is my mug. Uh, we got it on tour um, from an artist. Um, so earlier this year. Yeah. Yeah, it's pretty nice. Um, yes, thank you for joining us. We are Charmer Finches, as I mentioned earlier. Um, what are we going to play now? Concentrate on breathing. This is a song... Um, that we wrote uh, last year during lockdown. We're back in lockdown again. Yay for that. Woohoo. <laughs> um, <laughs> we, I got into meditation a little bit last year um, as a sort of coping mechanism, I guess, for lockdown. <laughs> Keep myself calm. It's necessary. Uh, and this is a song sort of inspired by that. Um, we also wrote a bunch of haikus and they ended up kind of becoming the lyrics of this song. Yeah, yeah. it's called Concentrate on Breathing and it's got a music video online. Who likes a mystery? <laughs> if you said yes, that one's for you. It's on YouTube. Yeah. Bit of film noir film inspired. Fatal. Yeah. Yeah. Fun. <laughs> Hello Jerry. <laughs> Thanks for joining. All right, all right. <laughs> uh, what do I, I need to keep her down here? Okay. <clears throat> Ooh, try to concentrate on breathing and let your thoughts fall like water to the floor. It's all just the trick of the light When the dark recoils And the morning invites us in Crawling and unfurling Let the sunlight soak through our skin Wash away the night that has been Concentrate on breathing and let your thoughts fall like water to the floor. When you put an end to what you're seeing, know that it's all just the trick of the light. Simple as that. As simple as that. Air around us burning. of the eyes, the unhinging of your mind. Ooh, try to concentrate on breathing and let your thoughts fall like water to the floor. When you put an end to what you're seeing, don't let it all just the trick of the light. As simple as that As simple as that As simple as that As 
banjos we put <laughs> we put a poll up on our instagram yesterday asking what what was it what would you rather a banjo or a slap in the face <laughs> you kind of have to watch the video to understand it though but yeah the banjo is winning so far is it yes you've you've yes. seen the update okay yeah i mean it was a little bit you know they were drawing for a little while. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> Let us know what you'd rather. <laughs> okay. Yes, Jerry loves the banjo. That's great to hear. Um, there are some uh, banjo dislikers out there, I must say. Yeah, but um, this is a banjo positive space. Um, yeah, let's, let's keep that vibe. <laughs> uh, we're going to sing a song about gratitude. Ivy and I tend to write a lot of sad songs, um, and then we thought, let's try and write a happy song. So we wrote this one and then played it to some friends, and they said, oh, it's actually kind of sad. So it turns out maybe we can't write happy songs. <laughs> There's um, a bridge in there dedicated to everybody uh, who's listening, and just a thank you. So thanks. <laughs> What about the lovely accordion? <laughs> or, um, I'm not. I'm just not going to say anything. I don't want to get on, on anyone's bad side here. <laughs> right. Okay. <clears throat> Oh, how 
Thanks so much. Aw, thanks, Jerry. That's that's for you, Ivy. That's a compliment. <laughs> Aw, thank you. Aw, that's lovely. <laughs> Where is the record title? Yes, that is the title track of our um, last album that we put out in 2019. Yeah. Yeah. Got a new one coming. We're going to play a song now uh, that is the newest single that we've just released. Uh, it's called Canyon and it's, um, we actually wrote it inspired by dreams. We both had dreams of leaping into the unknown. I had a dream of uh, leaping over a canyon and uh, you wondering sure. if I would cross. And Mabel had a dream of jumping out of a tree into yeah. whatever. Yeah. <laughs> I think, yeah, it's been, it was a bit of a theme. We, we went into this album sort of not um, just seeing what would happen, really. It was a lot more, it was very playful and a lot of the songs were written in the recording process, which was quite interesting. We normally... Um, just mm. play songs live for years and years and then record them. And this time, because we had lockdown, um, we weren't touring our last album and we decided, why don't we just make a new album? And we wrote all these songs that we'd never performed to people before and now we're only just starting to do that. And this is actually the first time we will be performing it to an audience, this song, mm. which is... Exciting. <laughs> a bit nerve-wracking. Um, yeah, we've just released it. It's online. It's up on wherever you like to stream music. So go give it a listen. And uh, there is a video coming. We made a video in our kitchen uh, with a, <laughs> this sort of backdrop. Um, yeah. During lockdown. Yeah, we normally <laughs> Yeah, tried our hands at, at um, being camera people. Uh, yeah, so look out for that. <clears throat> Another cold day where I blend into the grey We are both cold and empty Cold air, cold feet Throw me into the deep Throw me into a deep sleep I had a dream Snow is all I could see Never know unless you 
She took my hand and said, let's fly And we'll lift off over a canyon And we'll, and we'll drift off Fly through the fog And we'll lift off over a canyon And we'll, and we'll drift Another bad night waking me up with a fright I was alone in the desert Lying flat on the ground Creatures crawled from my mouth and flew into the distance A girl appeared in a tree Told me to climb up and see Something she had discovered When I got to the top She said we had to jump off And counted down from 100 she tried to ease my mind We'll never know unless we try She took my hand and said let's fly And we'll lift off over a canyon And we'll, and we'll drift off Fly through the fog Fly through the fog and we'll lift off over a canyon and we'll and we'll drift off, not knowing if we'll cross, not knowing if we'll cross. Thank you. Thanks so much. <clears throat> All right. Is anybody um, a Leonard Cohen fan out there? Let us know. Um, this is one of our Leonard Cohen favourites. Yes. This is going to be um, our second last song. We hope you've enjoyed your time with us. <laughs> <laughs> and we've enjoyed playing for you, so... Yeah, thanks for coming along. Uh, if you like what you hear, you can donate um, <clears throat> to our PayPal link, um, and that might be in the description, I'm not sure. Um, or you can come and join our Patreon page. There are a couple of patron, patrons here. Hello, Mark. And Matt, I think, was here, and Anna. <laughs> yeah, thank you. We are so appreciative for our patrons who have been... Um, helping us basically pay for um, all of the things that involve, you know, bringing out music. Music videos cost money and um, it's really wonderful to have those supporters. So if you'd, re if you'd like to support what we do, um, you can go and join that page and you get um, all... Behind the scenes content. Yeah. And it's good little Special community. Things. <laughs> Yeah. Um, they've been helping us out with um, our getting our new logo and getting our new poster and all these things um, that are behind the scenes that we're sharing with them. So, yeah, you can go join that if you'd like. We are Charmer Finches. Um, yeah, got a couple more. This is the Leonard Cohen song. We won't say which one it is, you can guess. It's not the right chord. It's four in the morning, the end of December. I'm writing you now just to see if you're better. New York is 
cold, but I like where I'm living. There's music on Clinton Street all through the evening. I hear the your building, your little house deep in the desert. You're living for nothing now. I hope you're keeping some kind of record. Yes, and Jane came by with a lock of your hair. She said that you gave it to her. That night that you planned to go clear. Did you ever go clear? Oh, the last time I saw you, you look so much older. Your famous blue raincoat was torn at the shoulder. You'd been to the station to meet every train, and you came home without. Treated my woman to a flake of your life, and when she came back, she was nobody's wife. Well, I see you there with the rose in your teeth. One more thin gypsy thief. Well, I see Jane's awake. She sends her regards. Well, what can I tell you, my brother, my killer? What can I possibly say? I guess that I miss you. I guess I forgive you. I'm glad you stood in my way. If you ever come by here, for Jane or for me, will your enemy asleep? This woman is free. Yes, and thanks for the trouble you took from her eyes. I thought it was there for good, so I never tried. Yes. Thank you. If you guessed a uh, famous blue raincoat, you were right. <laughs> <laughs> and Mark, you can send us a message in uh, Patreon if you like, a song idea. That would be lovely. <laughs> All right. All right. Okay, um, what are we going to do? This one is Pockets of Stones, and it, it was the first single that we released off our upcoming album, um yeah you can stay tuned for the upcoming album via our email list or just following us on facebook or instagram um yeah we've got some one more single coming out uh later in the year and then the album in october the album's called wonderful oblivion 
you heard it here first. <laughs> um, yes. This one is called Pockets of Stones, and I have a different guitar for this. I'd just like to say um, a big thanks to Two Way Street Coffee House for having us. We really appreciate it. Yeah, and we've had a great time. Thank you for joining us too. All right. This, this is Pockets of Stones. We've been Charmer Finches. Thanks so much.
Thank you so much. Thank you. Oh, yes. Wait a minute. Oh, <laughs> my goodness. We'll give them a second to put their headphones on. Yeah. Here we go. We can hear you now. <laughs> Yeah, wow. so fantastic, you guys. Just absolutely mesmerizing your harmonies uh, and the lyrics and just the musicianship. It's just wonderful. Like, such uh -huh. a beautiful evening, afternoon, morning of music wherever you are. So thank you. So Don't forget to donate. You can hear their music on all your favorite streaming services. I just looked on Amazon and all their albums are on there. So yes. it's like really easy to listen to go like their pages so go absolutely. support their music that way too www.twowaystreet.org is where you can uh donate and we will be accepting donations through sunday for charm of finches so please make sure that uh, you hop on over and donate um and also thank you very much to tim kendall who's in the background running uh the whole show here tech wise making sure that uh, everything's working. So we really appreciate him. So thank you to Tim. Yeah, tomorrow we have a sing around at 2pm. If you can make it out, uh, bring your favorite song and sing one or two for us. And then next Friday, we have sanctified grumblers. Yeah. So don't miss that show. Yes. So everybody at the two way street plays an encore and we would love it if you guys would play an encore for us. <laughs> For sure. Yeah, we can <laughs> definitely do that. Yeah. <laughs> so much. Thanks so much for having us. Yeah. Uh, um, yeah, we've had a great time. We're going to play a song um, that's actually the title track of our new album, Wonderful Oblivion. And um, I guess it's, it's a song about death and dying, um, but it's one of the less sad songs, we hope. It's more whimsical and wandering. Mm -hmm. um, it was um, inspired by the TV show Six Feet Under. Our favourite TV show. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Give us a shout out if you if you like Six Feet Under as well. Yeah. Um, and our dad's also an undertaker, so. <laughs> Fun fact about <laughs> us. All right. I might just double tune.
Have a great night or day. 